What's up, YouTubers? Uh, so we finally did it. We hit 25 whole subscribers. And so just the other day, I sent out those packs, that Mystery Booster Pack and the Core 21 Pack to that one faithful sub that won the giveaway. So don't miss the next giveaway. Be sure to like, share, and definitely subscribe to be eligible for giveaways. Don't forget that you have to have your um, account set to public in order to be um, to show on my list. So if you want those giveaways, and if you are a subscriber, which you definitely should be, make sure that you are public so that you can be counted. So today we have three pre-release packs, and my LGS was kind enough to add two draft booster packs and a set booster pack. So let the, let's get these things um, unwrapped and start cracking. Oh, fight the urge. That's what she said. Oh gosh, okay. Let's go ahead, Mighty Morphin, Kraken Rangers. Okay, YouTubers. So all together we have um, 24 draft booster packs and we have three um, set booster packs. So the draft booster packs contain uh, 10 commons, 3 uncommons, 1 rare or rare myth or mythic rare, um, full art basic land, and a token or add. Let's see what we pull. So of course the rules, mythics and rares, mythics get sleeves, auto sleeve, okay. We can do rares too, foil rares, if there are foil rares in here. So, okay, looks like we're getting into our uh, three uncommons Mind Carver, Goma, Fat of Vanguard, Relic Axe. Okay, cool. So this is one of the flipping cards. <laughs> I'm sorry that uh, I don't know exactly what that's called, but I know they flip. So it's actually a sorcery. And if you flip the other side, let's hide these cards real quick. Uh, it's a land. Pretty cool. So this two, two arrows means the backside. One arrow means the front. Let's go and wrap this puppy up. Mm, yeah. Let's see what this is. This should be the full art basic land. Oh, okay. Real pretty. And. Oh. Okay. Keep going, keep going. Try to make this video not super long, but this is uh, my first look at the set, and also uh, likely many of you guys' first set, first uh, kind of look at it. Uh, field research, core celebrant, molten blast. Oh gosh, that's a bad day. Anti cognition, reclaim the waste, oblivion hunger, oblivion's hunger. Feed the Swarm, and Grotag, Bug Catcher. That was my nickname in high school. Uh, Prowling Felidar, Three Uncommons, Merfolk Falconer, Marasa Root Gazer, Grazer, just grazing roots, Skyclave, Shadowcat, and wait a minute, that's the same card we just pulled. Huh, two Mythics, two packs, two Mythics. Wow. That is uh, promising, I guess. It's very promising. Ooh, foil in common. Put our foils right here. This is a pretty cool island. Wow, it looks really neat, actually. Hmm. And an insect. So I think that we'll go with the 24 um, draft booster packs and then we'll get the, we'll look at the promo cards and then we'll open the set boosters. 
forest. This is a different order. Oh, okay. It was kind of backwards. Hmm. Uh, Coral Helm Chronicler. That's rare. Oh, we don't have a rare spot yet. Now we do. Okay. So, Skyclave Cleric, Uncommon. And uh, Ballista. Enters tapped. I guess having the option, though, of either playing a, a creature or a land is, is definitely worth that. Uh, two drop for one three. Gain two life. Relic Golem. More Folk Wind Robber. And a Commons. Blood Price. That's a cool, that looks pretty cool. Okay, we're gonna kind of blaze through the commons so we can get this video done in a decent amount of time. Uh, I think this box is also backwards, or this pack is also backwards. So looks like two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten commons. Yep. On commons, soaring thought thief. Kenyon Jerboa, super cute, little cutie. Have another flip card. Cool. Uh, this one's gonna be uh, rare or mythic rare. <gasps> oh. Oh yeah, so they just added another color and reprinted this card, or I guess kind of brought him back. Omnath, Locus of Creation. This is highly sought after. Um, okay, so currently on TCG Low, as of what's today, 918, this is like a $70 card. Nope, scratch that, that's for foil. Okay, it's not a seven dollar card, but I'm not going to take any more time finding that out. But anyways, this is a, a highly sought after card, and I know people are going to hit me up for that. Full Art Land. This started and ended with this card. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Commons. Uncommons, Shadow Stinger, Relic Vial. What does this card do? Sacrifice a creature, draw a card. This is cool because I mean, if you have a lot of tokens. Wow. That's a cool card. Right? Tokens count as creatures. I think so. I haven't played in a while. Obviously. Uh, Palaka Predation. Oh my gosh. Caverns. And the Jace. Uh, hitting a lot of mythics. What do we have so far? One, two, three. This is our fourth mythic in the <laughs> in these packs. And this is one of the reasons that I, I actually favor uh, pre-release packs uh, over like a standard booster. I'll tell you now that uh, at least for Core 21, I, I was pulling a lot better cards out of pre-release packs um, instead of, uh, you know, as opposed to booster packs. So... That's something. I don't know if that's really a thing. Oops. If that's really like, you know, a real thing that happens. Oops. But it is definitely a thing that happened to me. So, and I've opened, I think, four or five Core 21 boxes. Consumption. And Blood, blood Bog. Enters tapped. Shadows Verdict. Foil Uncommon. Only the second foil we've gotten so far. And we have four Mythics. <laughs> that is crazy. Okay. Uh, anyways, let's see how it goes. So far so good, I think, you know? What do you guys think? Nine. Wait, one, two, three, four, eight, nine. Okay. 
Thundering Spark Mage. Oh, I put a rare in the wrong spot. Dang it. Kite Sail Cleric. Kalhazan Ambush. What is behind there? I'm all of Skyclaves. And Territory. This looks like an equipment card. Gets plus two, plus two, flying and first strike for three drop. Oh, and then four. Two white and two colorless. Ooh, a rare uh, foil. Luminarch Aspirant. This is what you need whenever you get a headache. Just take an aspirant. Foil you. Okay. I think we are doing pretty good, ladies and gentlemen. This one has 10. Okay. Goma, Fat of Vanguard. Oh, what is this? A full art, right? Extended art. Canyon Jerboa. Landfall. Whenever a land enters the battlefield under your control, creatures you control get plus one, plus one, ten to turn. That is. Wow. That is really cool. Kazul Fury. Flip card. Let's see what's behind it. Angel of Destiny. Mythic Rare. Number five. Number Cinco. Number Ha. Forest. Oh, I really like the forest. You know, sometimes forests don't look like forests, but this one looks like forest. I don't know if that's confusing. Construct. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. So if it has nine, let's see. Fearless Fledging. Basswood Surge. Bayeen Bale. Creatures your opponent controls get minus two, minus oh. For two mana. Cool. Uh, coast. It's an island. Archpriest of Ayana. Archpriest. Archpriest. Common foil. And another forest that looks like a forest. Well, well done. Oh, this is actually a really cool looking token. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Spring Mantle Cleric. Merfolk Wind Robber. Ravager's Mace. Whoa, it's a rare, it's like an extended art, it's cool, like the border actually like kind of, I don't know if you understood what that meant, but it was very important. Let's take a look at the other side before we look at the next card, tap land, forest, and this one, forest, oh, okay, oh that was a rare. <laughs> Look at me knowing exactly how these packs are put together. Resolute Strike. Oh. Commons, I care about you, but just not right now. Relic Vile. Cinder Clasm. Amiria Captain. Glass Pool Mimic. Rare. Awesome job. Awesome job on that card. Man, I should be, I should be sleeping these, cause they're super cool. Is there another one in here? Okay. Anyways, land. Double side. You can use this to represent a double faced card. Great. That's fantastic. Oh, actually, that's really helpful. Okay. I was wondering how that was gonna be played in decks. Fenner and Adventure, Adventurer, -er -er -er. Marfolk Wind Robber. Like if you fart, he catches it. He's a wind robber. Okay, Moss Pit Skeleton. Another rare. Flip. Destroy all non land permanents. Eight mana. That's okay. That's a pretty cool card. Or it could be a Plains. Tap land. Okay. 
Okay. All right. Making decent time. About halfway through the Jeff Booster packs. I'll speed up just a little bit more. Grotag Night Runner. Kite Sail Cleric. Bean. Bean. Like bee scene. Ho! Oh. Mythic Rare. Number. What's that, like 30? Seagate, Stormcaller, really cool art, way to go, Anna Steinbauer, way to go, it's cool looking art, Mythic Rare, let's sleeve her, let's sleeve her, I never call her again, Mountain is really cool looking, way to go, Adam Peckett. There is a mess right next to me. Uncommons, Thwart the Grave, Shatter Skull, Minotaur, Colony Ambush, and Rolling Vortex. At the beginning of each player's upkeep, Rolling Vortex deals one damage to them. Whenever a player casts a spell, if no mana was spent to cast that spell, Rolling Vortex deals five damage to the player. Wow. And it prevents life. That's kind of cool. There must be like some kind of mechanic that allows for a lot of uh, casting with no no using of mana. Swamp. And our first add card. That's almost a rarity right now. Great. More rare than our mythics. Lithoform Blight. Thundering Rebuke, Akuma Warrior, Akuma Matata, Vilath, World Sculptor. Real cool. Six drop. Wow. It creates a 0-1 green plant creature for each basic land you control. So I mean here, if you have basic lands, then of course that's uh, six tokens. And then you can beef it up with the landfall ability. That's crazy. Way to go. Okay. Getting close, ladies and gents. It's only about 16 minutes in, or 17 minutes in, something like that. And the intro, I guess. Veteran Adventure, Merfolk Wind Robber, Tangled Florahedron. It's actually really cool, man. I mean, yeah, it's alive. Let's just say that. It's alive. So two for a 1-1, one, one, add green mana. You're going to actually hide the other card. And then, or you can uh, have it come into the battlefield tapped for just a forest. Or one green mana. Scatter, Shatter Skull, Charger. Okay. They brought Kicker back, which I really like. I really enjoy Kicker. Because later in the game, you know, you have all these uh, kind of lower cards. Ooh, Foil Rare. And, I mean, it's cool. You have all this extra mana. Why not kick it? Why not kick it? You ain't got a lie to kick it. Okay, Island. Ooh, wow. Okay, comments. On commons, base camp. Wow. So this is part of that um, a cleric, rogue, warrior, or wizard. So you can add one, one mana of any color. Uh, it comes into play tap, but you, you can add one mana of any color as long as it's to pay for one of those or an ability. That is really cool. Uh, Ruin Crab, mm, Full Art Uncommon, and Zuff Consumption. Um, yeah. Swamp on the other side. Akiri Fearless Voyager. Swamp. Add card. I'm really excited to get to those promo cards. I guess they're, they're are they called pre-release cards? Either way, they're shiny and they have dates on them. I like dates. Sometimes I'll eat a prune though, but you know, whatever. Relic Golem. Soaring Thought Thief. Tangled Florahedron. Wayward Guide Beast. That's a really cool picture, man. Look at those horns. Wow. I think he just wants to give you a hug. What do you think? 
swap. We're getting mighty close. I actually kind of want to hide those before I open, until I open all of the... Hmm. Oh man, that's a really cool looking card. Okay. So there are definitely some cool looking cards in the comments, comment slot, but it's kind of getting through these packs. Verizal, the split current. Legendary creature. Come on. Come on, you. Some of the other packs are pretty easy to open. Oh, I think this one's upside down. So, yep. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. At least nine. Sometimes ten. Common. Here comes our uncommon. Marasa Sproutling. Skycleave Plunder. And, uh, ooh, that looks like an unfair fight. What do you think? Okay, here's a rare. Magmatic Channeler. Cool art. Okay. Oh. This one is also backwards, so... Commons. On commons. Blood Thief's Thirst. Blood Chief's Thirst. Goma Fara Vanguard. Uh, Song Mad Treachery and Ruins. Our Rare or Mythic. Soul Shatter. Each opponent sacrifices a creature or planeswalker with the highest converted mana cost among creatures and planeswalkers they control. Wow, so that's one way to um, destroy some planeswalkers. And those things can get pretty pesky. Okay, so I am actually going to move these out of the way. I'll see if I can move them somehow. Mm, I'm going to put this over there. Okay. Oh, yeah. That worked. That totally worked. Super sneaky. Okay. Commons. Uncommons. Relic X. Rolling, roiling Regrowth. And Shelter. It appears that the third uncommon is always going to be a uh, flip card, Eldo, I'm not sure, but that has been the case, I think, for most of our packs. Uh, Legion Angel. Foil Uncommon has some some lines there. I don't know if you can see it, but yep, has some lines. Okay. The old switcheroo. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, this one's backwards. Okay, that's okay. Uh, foil Uncommon, or Foil Common, excuse me. Vision Angel, once again. On the commons and our commons. Okay. I'm like super excited. Oh man, that card was totally visible. Super excited for these. Let's just do this. I don't know if you saw that, but if you did, don't tell me. I'll open it in a sec. Okay, this one's backwards, so. Oh man, and my foot just fell asleep, so. It looks like I'm stuck here for a couple hours. So, uncommons. Oh wow, okay. Well, that revealed our mythic, but it's a mythic flipper. Eh. Okay, I don't know if you know what flipper is, like the old show, but I tried to do a dolphin and I just. It didn't work. Uh, enters the battlefield, you may pay three. If you don't, enters tapped three life. We get top seven cards of your library. You may put a creature card from among them into the battlefield. If that card has converted mana cost three or less, it enters with three additional plus one plus one counters. Put the rest on the bottom of your library in a random order. Wow. That's crazy. Oop, excuse me. I poked the cord. Okay, fill out cards. Or full art land and uh, yeah. Okay, let's look at these cards. I'm really excited to see what they are. Um, okay. 
Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Ooh, perfect. This one's actually facing downwards. Uh, Zagras, Thief of Heartbeats. That's cool. It's a cool looking card. Okay, and the next one. Oh, okay. Tajura, Paragon. Okay. And this one, we can kind of see it. So I'll flip. Clear water pathway. So you can either use this for um, island or blue, or you can use this for black. Really cool. That's cool. Okay, let's move on to our set boosters. So the set boosters have kind of a it's like a it's like a buffet, right? It's like a uh, it's like a, a couple different courses. So let's look at our appetizers. Or welcome, whatever. The welcome actually consists of one art card slot, one land slot, and uh, I think six common uncommons. So here is our art card. I've seen a couple of the openings so far, and these actually can be uh, signed. I don't know if they can be signed in the standard. There's like some stuff on here. Uh, different pile. Okay, uh, foil swamp, really cool. And it looks like we're gonna have six co common, uncommon, four, five, six. Mm, okay, anyways. Booyah, fireworks. Uh, but I like to call it entree. One head turner slot. Two wild card rarity slots. So here is our head turner. And we noticed this earlier and it actually did the trick, didn't it? Uh, Dominic Mayer, way to go. Here comes our wild card rarity slots times two. Uh, common, blood price. Okay. And spare supplies. Okay, those aren't super wild, but that's okay. <laughs> this is our big finish, or as I like to refer to, uh, dessert number one. Big finish has a Kamandu Mammoth, and it turns into a land also, if you like. And anti-cognition, and this thing. So the epilogue, or dessert number two, which usually are full by now, so that's why it doesn't have to be super awesome. Uh, it's either going to be a token or an add slot. Okay, pack number two. Look at that art. That's cool. I wonder how these will be, like, you know, uh, as far as collectible. Will they be collectible? We're into the welcome. Uh, connected commons and uncommons, head turner, that is actually a really cool card, uh, Pascal Blanche, way to go, um, wild rarity, the next two cards, and then the big finish after these two cards, so wild rarity so far have been commons, squad commander, Uh, uncommon foil and a plant. Wow, that's a great looking plant. One more pack. Thanks a lot for sticking around and watching this video. Uh, hope you kind of learned how these packs are going. Um, here's our art. Mm -hmm. Okay, wild rarity or that was called wild card rarity and that's just fancy ravager's mace something other than a common and crawling barons wow so this is actually one of those cards that uh they spoiled early and it was pretty cool it's actually really cool 
I think this is going to be a, a pretty heavily played card. Crawling Barons. Ooh, man, I crimped the crap out of that thing. All right. There we go. Because if, if I leave it in there and then I see it sometime, I'm going to think that it's totally damaged. Not good. Okay, Nimble Trap Finder. Spare Supplies Foil. And a really cool kitty cat. Thanks a lot. I think that we did pretty darn good. Let's see where our mythics are here. <laughs> oh my gosh. Seven mythics. We pulled seven mythics. I purchased three pre-release uh, packs. Um, and of course we got those extra, the extra stuff. But anyways, like, share, and subscribe. Combs Collectibles out.